we're going to have a live example showing the scripting register command capabilities within our vehicle spy software. So this is our monitoring tab called our messages view and over here you'll see the rights to the I2C registers using what's called our function blocks. We also report the Surdi's image status so we calculate the frames per second and we'll tell you what is physically going on on the coax or shielded twisted pair link over here as it pertains to data type and resolution. Over here we just have a very simple color bar demonstration with 100 um, uh, pixels by 200 and I'm changing the frames per second and then we're also changing the number of bars. So what you're going to see here is the changes to the registers occurring every two milliseconds changing from eight bars to four to two to one and then when I start to increase the frames per second you can see the artifacts start to going away. So now we can do this color bar demonstration and we can start changing the color bars and now we can see what happens when we change that time. So right now we're about two milliseconds so you can see one, two, three, four, five changes only at 10 frames a second within those so 10 frames. At 10 frames a second. second we're able to see the different color bars changing at 20, 30, 60, Over here we're reporting the frames per second and the Ethernet port 12, load. 130, 150. Now we start seeing some changes. Because the, the bars are not being painted long enough when the frames per second keeps changing. Now we jump back to 10 and we can see those individual frames again getting mashed um, in the middle of uh, trying to change it so we can slow this back down.